Does it fit? Is it good? There you go. All right, got mine all packed up too. Cooler's fitting. Small dry bag is gonna be right there. Big bag down in here in the front. All right, so the general plan is to... Snake. So the general plan is to kayak 12 miles today. We're gonna go down river to Montague Hollow, about two miles away from where our takeout point is. Should be good. I mean, we're probably gonna run into a few sections that are... Oh, look, ducks. Check it out, there's ducks. It's about 80 degrees, you can get up to about 85. Sunny, not a cloud in the sky. Couldn't ask for a better day with good friends. Looks like some fun. What's up, Alex? Oh, not much, just harder than I thought. Raise them up, guys. First Medina trip starting right now. What's up, man? Yeah, having fun? Yes, sir. First time using the Walmart kayak, Sun Dolphin Aruba 10. It's treat me pretty well. You know, I'm scooting along the bottom quite a bit, but I don't know if that would be better in a, in a nicer kayak. I got this No Limits paddle from Academy. It's pretty good. It's real hard. Fiberglass, you know, it's doing real well. Lightweight. What's up, Farlow? How you doing, man? We got Alex behind. Farlow's taking a little snack. Having fun, just ran a couple rapids. Would have gotten them on film, but they caught us by surprise. All right, let's do it. Hey, we did it. <laughs> We've probably been going, what, Farlow, about an hour? Yeah. There's more water than we were expecting. At least more water than I was expecting. A lot more beautiful than I was expecting, but. Here we go, bud, hit it hard. There it is. Yeah. Here comes Farlow. The party barge. Farlow with all of Alex's stuff. Farlow's got all of Alex's stuff. Look how many coolers Farlow has. Oh gosh, you got me. You guys get to see my view. Not too bad, is it? So the hope and the goal is to camp somewhere like this area. You know, we all brought hammocks. Set up a little fire, because in Texas, the riverbed, even the cleared area, that's still part of Texas, the state of Texas. So it wouldn't be until you go up over where it forms a bank. Yeah, we would be free to camp, do whatever. We've got the yak cruising. Fear break. We took a little bit of a break, gathered up some of my gear, made the cockpit a little bit more organized. Here we go. Here comes Alex, shredding the rapid. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah. Woo! 
love shooting rapids. It's just way too much fun. Whenever I film, I have to use my hand as a paddle. Well, so I won't go straight. Oh no. This weekend happens to be the Medina River cleanup. There's about 200 people out here on the river cleaning up, taking care of our streams and rivers in Texas. We appreciate it. All you, buddy. Oh yeah, with these. All right, man, it's all you. I don't have anywhere to go. Straight. Oh, there it is. <laughs> we pulled over on the side of the river, get a little bit of a food break, eat some sandwiches, hang out, rest our arms. Beautiful hill country. Got the Sundolphin Aruba 10, Sundolphin Aruba 8 SS, Pelican 100. I'm not sure what model it is. Sit on top. So far, the Pelican is crushing this river. And I've liked my, I've liked my Aruba 10. I have had zero issues, really. He's packing a lot of weight with Alex's cooler. And his own cooler at that. And I've even got one too. Check that out. We all bought the coolers this week thinking we were tight, but uh, that's been the only point of friction on this whole trip. But we figured it out. Farlow's carrying the weight. <laughs> I almost lost my drive bag. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh. All right, it's about 5.30, 5.45. Getting a little tired, making our way to camp. So we just kind of realized that we were going a little slower than we should have been all day. We might not make camp, but we're sure going to push for it. We have about an hour and a half of sunlight. We got Alex coming down the rapids. But we're sure gonna make a push. I'll keep you updated. So we think we've made it to camp. We're not sure. We're double checking with the GPS. Farlow scouting out the campground. All right, what are we thinking? We're not there yet. We're very close. We're 300 yards away, maybe 400. We're just right there. See, we're close to all these houses. What are you guys thinking? All right, group consensus is make it to camp. See, we have working with there. Let's hope it's not worse than this. We'll see. All right, Alex, here's your phone, man. We made it to camp. We were able to get a fire going, cook some sausages, jalapeno cheese. We ended up doing about 12 miles of paddling today. We didn't get into camp until about what time, 7.30? It was pretty late when we got in, a lot later than you'd want to. But it was a pretty grueling push to get our hammock set up with our rain flies and the fire built. Tomorrow we have about a two mile kayak back to the car so it should be pretty easy. I know all of our arms are toast. 12 miles was pretty ambitious for a shallow river. It's coming back. The raccoon's back. Oh, yeah, we've got a raccoon or a cat or something. Let's see if we can catch these cats or raccoons. Where is it? To the right? By my hammock? Hey, it's Farlow's hammock. Well, I don't see him so we're good for now. I would have started to film earlier, but it was pitch black. We got out here like 4.45 in the morning because everybody was freezing cold. Alex, what was the low temperature? 54. It was 54 when we got out of our hammocks. We made the executive decision to quit trying to sleep and just start a fire. So we've graduated to burning our bench for science, of course. More to come. Yeah, more to come. We'll <laughs> see what happens. Uh, you know, there's a lot of driftwood around here, so we'll see if it goes up in a blaze. Alex somehow managed to watch Netflix to go to bed and he dumped a bunch of Advil in his system, so he's doing all right. Yep. Which is good because he has to drive me home. Yep. Probably have breakfast soon and paddle the two miles home. Look how beautiful that is. We've got this muscle milk protein shake. Maybe having this and probably a honey stinger waffle for breakfast. Maybe a cliff bar if I'm still hungry. 
Looks like Carlos has got a muscle like, move. I've never heard you say that. What'd you say? <laughs> <laughs> the record will show that Alex did say that. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you put up, put out your fires when you're camping, and you do stupid stuff like light huge logs on fire. Which gate would did? Oh. <laughs> oh God! I'm not really getting the log now. This is the uh, hammock tent setup we got going on. Got my rain fly, hammock, a lantern, dry bag with clothes. Cool little camping spot, really. It's kind of hard to put stakes in. Over through here, we got Alex. He's got his hammock as well. Rain tarp, a little setup. Time to break it down. We're leaving camp, beginning day two, final stretch. Alex launching right now. Oh, he goes. Here he goes. <laughs> Here he is. Here I go. <laughs> What's up, guys? We just finished up the trip. Farlow and Alex are going to grab the truck. I'm sitting here waiting with the kayaks over there. You know, overall, it was a pretty good trip. We uh, figured out some kinks. Had a great time. Ran some fun rapids. Tons of beautiful rivers in Texas. Maybe hit the Medina again when the flow gets better. We have one planned for July 15th, but we haven't decided which river we're gonna go on. And a new set of folks are gonna be on that one. So stay tuned. Thanks.